Hi! Today we are going to talk about sound waves and harmonics. There are many sounds around us, but do we really know what we are hearing? Let us first hear what is the difference between the two sounds here. The first one is an A note played by a clarinet. What about the second one? It is also an A note, but instead it is played by a violin. So why can we tell the difference between a clarinet and a violin if they are both playing the same A note? In order to understand this, it would be nice if we can visualize what the sound looks like. Luckily, we all have a device that can help us, which is a cell phone. You can actually download apps on the cell phone uh, so that it can display the sound signal through the microphone. Now we can see how a clarinet and violin sound looks like on a cell phone app. We can see that the clarinet and the violin gives very different sound waveforms, even though the frequency of the A note is 440 Hz. The reason they are different is that the sound is not made of a single tone, but also of higher order frequencies known as harmonics. If the fundamental frequency is 440 Hz, then the second harmonics will be 880 Hz, the third harmonics is 1320 Hz, and the fourth harmonics is 1760 Hz, etc. etc. We can see that the waveform will change depending on how much fundamental and also harmonics that are generated from the instrument. You may now wonder which harmonics is in the sound that we hear. We can go back to our powerful instrument the cell phone in order to do that. This time you can download an app that actually looks at the frequency spectrum of the sound to study the harmonics. This is an example of one of them. So if I sing into it like this, you can see the frequency distributions, the harmonics of the sound. We can now use this to study what is the difference between a clarinet and a violin. This is what the frequency spectrum looks like when the clarinet is playing an A note. Here we see the fundamental is above 430 Hz, and then we see a second harmonics, a third harmonics, a fourth one, the fifth, the sixth, the seventh, and the eighth. The main sound from a clarinet comes from the first eight harmonics. Now let us look at how the frequency spectrum looks like when a violin is playing an A note. We still see the first 8 harmonics from the violin, but it also has higher harmonics up to the 16th, the 24th, and even 26 harmonics. So the reason why we can tell the difference between the different sound is that our brain is able to tell the difference between the sound based on the set of harmonics that we hear. I hope you get a better understanding of sound and harmonics from this video. Bye-bye.